Good morning. Welcome to Wake the Bleep Up. You know something? It is really happening right here, right now, right where you are. Unspeakable, powerful, unceasing love streaming live into your heart, into every one of your 27,000 trillion cells. And you're going to tell me it's just kind of another morning and you're just feeling eh, the blahs or whatever. Uh-oh, not really. Not really. Don't believe in your thoughts. Don't believe in your feelings. Don't believe in this world. Uh-uh, because underneath this hologram, this ball racing through space and all these, these different varieties of life forms is the love stream and live, baby. And I can't tell you how happy that I am to share this news with you this morning. You know, man, happiness is just the next thought. Love is just in the next moment that we put our attention in the heart. You know, the, the path... That, 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 you know, yellow brick road path for you is exactly the moment that you pause, open up, put your attention in your heart. There is the path, direct route to unlimited abundance, abundance, joy, everything you could ever dream of because everything you could ever dream of is already yours, but you keep dreaming that there's something else going on. But not anymore, I swear. This thing is so real. What is this thing? This love thing is so real. It is more real than the so-called knock on wood, man. Knock on your noggin or get your, you keep banging your head against the, the, the wall that closes up in front of you every time you take the wrong turn. You know, we got, we got to go the road less traveled now. We really do. Isn't that funny that, that love is the road less traveled now? Can you imagine that? No, I can't imagine that. I can't imagine anything but be traveling on the love road because the love road is everything and everyone. So even in your darkest moments, your darkest days, or whatever you want to call it, you're still on the love road, baby. I'm telling you, it's just a little flip of a switch, man. You're already the goods. You're already in the stream. It is here and now. That's how I started, right? And it's just a flip of a switch if you want it. And you know what? We need to flip the switch. You need to flip the switch. Everybody on the planet is going to have an opportunity to flip the switch. And they're, they're not even, they can't even believe how easy and simple it is. We flip the switch every time we come on this love station, you see? We flip the switch from just kind of coming here. What's going on? WTF, you know? Who the hell is this guy? Right? To, wow, wow, wow. You know, maybe a wow. That there is a place, an oasis on the internet where it's only about one thing. As I said last night, it's exclusively about opening your heart to receive love and then exhaling the breath, so to speak. Receive the love on the inhale and exhale. Share that love. You have nothing to do with it except just that one little flip the switch. Open up! Open up! You don't have to keep the blinders on all day long, all lifetime long. You don't have to keep the shutters closed so it's nice and dark. And that everything seems to be, you know, like really dismal. And it just ain't going to work out. Nothing seems to work out. That You know, that's an abysmal. Aaron, rock star. Woo! Man, are you needed right now. You know, the subject this morning is we love love. We're a we when you jump on this love station, Aaron. We are a we. We are the love force. Isn't that a little relief from the grief, my brother? That we can just kind of have a, a real good pause, a real good time out, a real good mute <laughs> or a reboot <laughs> or whatever you would call it. But I am really heart-centered, sincere about the power that is amongst us in these love channel chats, <laughs> love stream channel chats we're having, Aaron. Because we begin become the we of the love force and just hold out with that idea all of a sudden. I promise you, do the math, do the science, be an observer of yourself today. Yeah, right? We all need love. Oh, we, we don't, we need it. Oh, we need it. We're the most desperate special needs on the planet, each one of us. We, we can't live. We think we're living. You know, it's like in that movie, The Avatar, you know, they had to 
they had to breathe with those masks on in this amazing, you know, all those astral colors and all that cool stuff that was going on on that planet. But we need to put the mask oxygen, the love oxygen mask on and breathe love. That's how special our need is. If we take this mask of connection to the love force off, we ain't going to we ain't going to survive even though the body can continue to do what it's do, what it does. This form can move about, the thoughts can do their things, the feelings can do th their thing, and the actions can do their things. And that's the world that we see, but only because we see it from that same place of forgetting to breathe love, man. We, we love. If there's enough of us that just kind of pause here for the, sh for the minutes that we're online, like you are here first thing, Awesome, Aaron. I can't tell you how much I love the love that's inside you. I can't tell you how much I love the love that is you, man. Right? So we come here, and I swear there's going to be thousands and millions of people going to be doing this with us. We are a we, and we love. And all I'm asking that they come on for five minutes, man. Five minutes. Five minutes to have a love break. You know, five minutes to receive love and give love for our world. For our families. I mean, I think even the, the worst of the worst, so-called, without judging, because the worst of the worst is still the love stream, right? So we can't even judge it. To me, if I say the worst of the worst and the best of the best, the love I feel in my heart is the same. You see? I don't think there's one person on this planet that doesn't have something they love. Right? Something that they can say they love. That I would say would maybe be pure, like a, like a pet or a child or something, right? Unless, unless that's even gone. So that's why we really, hey, Bacon Erger, good morning. Oh man, we are loving this morning. Bacon, we are loving this morning. We, we love love this morning. You know, this morning I got, I get up, you know, a couple hours before first light and I just sit. I highly recommend a good sit, man. In the love corner. In the love corner where the whole love universe is around you and you are in your little corner, they may be thinking you're isolated from everything else, right? <laughs> but no, and just kind of just be in the, be with yourself, capital S. The soul self, you know, that self which is the essence of you self. If you end up remembering, you can call me Connor. Okay, Connor, all right, I got it now, Connor. I love to call you Connor and Bacon, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, but anyway, you know, I'm constantly kind of laughing on the inside when I'm on these love stream. You know, that's like last night was an hour and 20 minutes. So can you imagine how healing it is to be in a positive state of mind for starters, right? More than that, we're in a we're in a big old possible opening of the heart so we can receive. You know, you guys aren't just listening. You're not here to 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 really learn anything. We are here to just receive the love on the inhale breath and to share it on the exhale breath. Share it with each other and share it out to the world. Now look at how many of us right now are there two and me is three. But one day actually online, and I'm only saying that we need to get everybody on the planet online with a purpose like this that we love. We just love. We're receiving love the love force, and we're giving love back to our planet. We're giving love back to beyond the planet. We're giving love back into ourselves. We're giving love back into the situations today, which is stripping us from that possibility of the love, right? That, that it might just strip us into a very depressed state. So we got to just, and so listen, right? Five minutes, five minutes of everybody's time to take a love time out on this planet. And you come and however you want to be receive love and share that love, it could be whatever denomination or non-denomination, religion or whatever. But it's, you know, people might call it prayer time. But why don't we huddle up as a world? Five minutes of everyone's time and come on and love. Bam! Bam! So Connor, Aaron, are you with me, man? Are you in for that? Clark is. I'm here for morning love fix, doing my yoga while my heart is opening up. The best. See, there it is. So listen, Clark, we just, we just had a profound opening. We had the biggest opening of our lives. Connor, Aaron, and me. And now you, Clark. 
And that is all that this thing is about. Whatever this thing is called the love force revolution. It is about the we. The we of, the, of everyone in the world. We is one family, one heart, one tribe. Yeah. Look it. Connor welcomes you, Clark. We all welcome you with the big love. This is the big love channel. And we've come here. And all that my heart is asking of every being on the planet is five minute time out. Regardless of religion, regardless of politics, regardless, regardless of beliefs, five minutes where we come on this neutral zone, this safe zone, this time out, world time out, safe zone, and we just hold love for the world. We hold love for a better day. And that's five minutes of every individual's time. Can you imagine? Do the math. Do the math. So thank you. If you're 10 minutes, that's double for the world. If you're 15 minutes, that's triple for the world. But five is the magic number. Five minutes. Because it's very hard to ask anyone, and Aaron, Connor, and Clark. We are hearts on a mission here. And I take that very, very to heart. And I take it right into your heart. As this thing starts to grow, and trust me, this energy is growing. I feel it in my heart, and my heart is the reality. Whatever you feel in your heart is your so-called reality. I feel the love back at you. But you are a heart on a mission, each of you. You need to have this little elevator speech about when you talk to people and say, Do you have five minutes? Do you have five minutes to open your heart to receive some of the love force that universal, only reality love, and then to share that with your loved ones, with yourself, bathe in it, and with our world. Five minutes. Would you all do that for me, please? And if they seem to be, well, I can do that. Well, just say, hey, just breathe in love and breathe it out. That's a simple little thing just to help you. And just don't make a big deal about it. But then if it feels right, help them here. Help them onto this line on this love line. You see what I'm saying, Clark? You can't, you cannot receive this stuff and not share it. I have a little saying, we love, we care, and we share. Would you, would you three amazing hearts do this with me, please? We're, we need a revolution and we need it fast. In other words, we need hearts activated really fast. Hearts can be activated really fast when they're open to love. So it doesn't, you don't have to go through a course. You don't have to go through therapy. You don't have to get fixed. No, you're not broken, kids. Clark, are you in with that? Aaron just put it down. Aaron just said yes. So, Connor, I want, I want to hear that, man, because this is real. This is an Armageddon. This is what we need to do right now. And it's what, is it really, is it really? You're already doing it. But we need to spread the word and we need to spread it fast. Woo! With one viewer, thank you, Aaron. Well, one is only one and one is every one. So there's millions, hold millions. This is a love force revolution unheard of unheard of before it's not just the words it's just not a movement it's not a movement this isn't a movement it isn't about me it's about we hearts online that really want to care about life man that want to qual thank you connor that means so much you we are so meant to be on this love line this morning i can't tell you how the whole vision for the love force revolution I've been over over a month now, twice a day, just pouring my heart out, feeling the love, feeling the power building here. And the whole vision for this whole thing, which has really been incubating in me for most of my adult life since I was 19, is really crystal clear, I am telling you. You know, I'm telling you, that is, uh, thanks, Connor. Thanks very much. Woo! With one viewer, thanks for hosting. Man, see, this is the sharing. We love, we care, we share. Now, Clark, you might be doing your yoga right now, but can you take time out and type in, I'm in, and I will do, I will do that love request. I will, I will be sharing this love potential of five minutes. Basically, just say to your friends. You don't have to go out beyond that, but I am. Five minutes, kids. Well, then what do you want me to do? People go, no, no, I don't have time. Fine. 
No, five minutes. We're just asking you for five minutes. One minute. One minute of opening your heart to love today and sharing it with our world. Thank you. Love you. Have a great day. Okay? All right. So I have a little... I'm off to get ready for school. Thanks for the morning vibes. Hey, Connor. Can't wait to be in this. Was this a little... Did you get a good bang for your, for your few minutes, Connor? And you're going off to school. So, man... What a great start and share the love, brother, would you? Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. All right. So I have a song for everyone to start off. Woo! Yes, sir. So, we, so let's, send, let's send Connor a bunch of love. Connor's going off into the, into the, into the, the big wide world right now. And we get to stay on as a we. Remember, you come online, and I'll repeat this to Clark. You come online to receive the love force in a breath, and the exhale is to be given out. There's no more just listening, sitting back in our comfortable little corners. Every heart needs to be activated, and you guys are willing to see if this is a go for you. So you receive and give. This is a nonstop heart activating channel we are on where people come to receive and give, receive and give, receive and give. It's a very active channel. It's a very active channel. I've got some news to share with you. Are you ready to hear what's true? I've got some news share with you. Are you ready to hear what's true, baby? I've got some news to share with you. Are you ready to hear what's true? I've got some news. What do you say, Clark? This is the gift that keeps giving. There it is. All right. Thank you, Clark. I've got some news to share with you. present moment of oh, is if you miss this moment you could miss this day Clark and if you miss this day there's a good chance you'll miss tomorrow so we have got to let go of every notion that's in our noggins let go of what just happened and be receiving this love now and sharing it out to the world because we are a we we are not me's the me is a M like this it's a closed letter look at how the me walks around today just about me, looking down, never looking up at people, never seeing the sky, never seeing what's going on, me. But look at the we. Oh, look at that. Open, 
open. We are open. We are ready to receive. We receive love force. We don't survive until we breathe the love force in with every breath. Otherwise, we are the walking dead, man. And that's a very popular show on TV. Are you ready? I've got some news to share with you, baby. Are you ready? so out of a state of grace let's say the state of our true nature so to speak and out of love quite frankly if there's anything going on that's troubling the heart it means we're out of love because the heart really can't be troubled when it's in love so we practice in that maybe we're going to experience a little more of this thing called love i mean no one can really there's no words to describe it perhaps it's just something that only you if you want to open we only we have nothing going on on this love station except to breathe in the possibility of what i just said brad and breathe it in deep because if you take one good diaphragm breath while you're on this love line this morning you're going to feel a little better and then as we exhale we share some of that love brad we don't we can't own love we can't possess love because that's not real love that's human stuff you know human stuff and rather than than love is trying to possess someone, control love. You're so needy that you're just trying to get anyone to appreciate you or listen to you on all that. It's not that here. We're trying to open up to what we call love force, man. And it's the supreme love force. It's the love is all there is. Dun, 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 dun. All you need is love, love. So we don't try to put a definition on it, but we try here. We more than try. We open up to feel 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 get through the, the you know the barbed wire of all these other feelings that usually yank us around pretty bad today you know tar and feather us drag us in the dirt but we're here to just see if we can just hold out that this is a possibility and really Brad all I'm all I would my dream is to have people come on for five minutes just five minutes Ideally, my this 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 list love time, which is 7 a.m. Pacific Standard, and my my 6 p.m. Pacific Standard, and just come on for five minutes, take a love break, and people from all walks of life, all colors, all the politician, all the different religions, and the non-denominational people, whatever whatever is your thing, it doesn't matter what your thing is, what however you so-called pray, if you pray, if you're an atheist, if you're, it doesn't matter. All I'm saying is, can we all give five minutes back to this world that we live in and that gives us life right and all the all the things that grow to give us food all I'm asking is that we we spend five minutes a day every being on this planet that's all and just open up to receive because you can't really give until you receive first you know what I mean Brad? if we close off this thing then we don't have any energy to do any of this stuff we wouldn't even be on this line but you're on this line because I think it's time on this line because I think it's time five minutes kids 
And I'm really holding out that that's five minutes where you're actually online. People say, well, I'll do it. I'll be there in spirit. Come on. No, no. Well, we have to show up now. We have to get this physical body to show up. No more of that, uh, I'll be there in spirit thing, you know. No. People are very, 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 very not so so good at following up on what they say. You know, it's called following up on your word. So to answer your question, Bratch, thank you again for coming on. Welcome to the Love Channel. You know, we say if you want to follow love, follow your heart. And then that's what it means if you want to follow this Love Channel because it has nothing to do with me. It has everything to do with love. And this is what the world needs now, really bad. And the, the luckiest people in the world are the people who need love, you know. People who need people are the, no, people who need love are the luckiest people in the world. And we are, I believe, totally desperate for it. I believe the world is at a critical time right now, as we all know, and maybe our lives individually at a critical time. What is a critical time, Clark? Is that you're not, as, you're just not on fire on the big we today. That it's not about you. I mean, each of you. If the, the real fire comes when you know you are hard on a mission and we are brothers and sisters on this planet. And there's nothing you need to do. You don't have to go serve the poor. You don't have to be a missionary. You don't have to do that stuff. Baby, just open your heart, receive, and give love. We're, we're going to, we're, we're, love conquers all. So we're just seeing what a, what, what a group of, of uh, the unlikelies, right? The unsung heroes of life. And we're going to pull everybody out that just is ready to really have a change of heart, man. That is just, just, you know, have no other options but to turn to, to, to love. I think we've exhausted all the options many, many times over, right? And we keep trying a little differently the same thing that we've tried. That's what they say insanity is, is keep doing the same thing over and over again, thinking you're going to get a different result, right? The, the, the thinking mind isn't, a, it is an instrument, it's not a master, it's not a dictator, it's an instrument and it follows this thing, right? So we need to get this thing activated and it's activated right now if you guys are here with me just re more than listening to me really, I want you to come here and breathe deeply, really, receive the love force, just open it up, this is your time out from all the demons, man, and then just share that love, really. This is an active channel. We are activating the heart every time we open in this moment. I've already talked about just this moment. Has anyone got a problem with just this moment and a breath? Do you see how we're cutting through all the dogma and all the crap and all the, the teachings that people say? I mean, God, give me a break. Everyone's talking about a teaching that you need to follow. Why don't we say, stop it? Stop it. We need love or we're going to die. We, if we're going to die if we don't breathe. Well, we die. Dolphins breathe consciously, kids, or they die. Dolphins, you know, the dolphin. We're dead if we're not attuned to breathing in. The only thing that will really not just keep us surviving, but thriving uh, as who we really are. So it's really just a breath by breath while you're on this love line. You'll see, this is going to catch fire. It's going to catch fire because all our, all our, all our elevator is speech. Does anyone have five minutes for love? Does anyone have five minutes to open your heart to receive some more good energy and then to share it with, with our family on the planet, with our planet? with the trees, with the animals, and with the kids, and the people starving in most of the world, the people that don't have a, a roof over their head in most of the, I mean, you see, you see, five minutes, five minutes, and if that's too much for you, one, if that's too much, if one, then just go for one breath, but by Jove, do something, do something. It's action. Love is useful only when it's in action, Clark. Only when it's in action. Only when it's in action. Not in the comforts of our little home and our comforts of our little life. Only when it's in action. And it's in action when you are radiating this love out to the world. Rockstar, I'm telling you, man. I feel, I feel like a soul brother in you. And Bratch, I do. Because I don't think this is our first time around. We've been in many battles. We're in a battle again, right? The big one. The big one. Because now we're addressing the inner battle. You know, 
the big one branch. That's what this is. But we don't have to get too concerned about it because the more we're in the love, the love conquers all. So we just hold it out now that you guys are feeling this in your heart and we're just about today, right? We live a life in a day here too. And we're just in a moment by moment uh, do or die situation. It's either love in or crap in. You choose. And ingestion is more important than digestion, my friends. What you let come in your brain? What you let come in through these eyes? What you let come in through these ears? What, 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 what you let go out your mouth, right? These are big moments, man. This is Armageddon. Because we're either in the love stream or we're not. There's no gray. You see what I'm saying? Because love is here and now. And it's asking us, saying, look, you are love, baby. Now just dive in. You are love. You are all love. You're not somebody who's trying to get love. You don't need love. We talked about needing it because you are love. And we're going to need it really bad until we wake up. <laughs> right? So yeah, so here's another song. So thank you. Thank you. Remember, we have some, some love practice today. We have to share the five minute or the one minute when we talk to people. Just help people remember that this moment that they are in, wherever you are, is a moment of love potential. Right? Clark, are you in on that? You still haven't said yes. You say nice things. That's awesome. But we need a yes on this now. We need some people in the world to say, yes, I will devote one minute of my day to love. Is that really? Are we so entitled? How did we get so closed off? That we, we could actually say to love itself. I'll see if I have one minute. And you know, one of the great, I'll mention it, one of the great saints in the Catholic tradition. St. Francis, have you heard of him? Well, I'll use this example. He was crying unbearably one day. So I don't need anything, even this computer. Well, you got the computer of your heart, brother. But, but let's just be practical too. We need common sense. <laughs> we need common sense. But it's how, you know, it's how we use things. Right? It's how we look at things. Things aren't bad. We don't need to, you know, walk around with the, like, like a gun day and a like little, little, little dodi cloth on. <laughs> it's how we use things, man. And in this sense, I think computers, I'm so in love with my computer because I get to share love with you. Hmm. And you get to be here on just maybe rebooting, maybe filling up like at a love station and you fill up with love. Otherwise, we're going to run out of gas. We might be running on empty on the love stuff, right? So listen, so Francis was walking along one day crying unbearably. Harris <laughs> laughed. Crying unbearably. And then his, his, his brother who started with him when he started that, that whole thing about, well, famous now, thousands, uh, so many hundreds of years later. Because he loved. But he was crying and they asked him, that his friend asked him, why are you crying? He says, because love is not being loved. To me, to me, that's the most powerful. That is mission. That is vision. That is everything that I am sharing with you guys. And all I'm saying is, can we afford one minute, five minutes, twice a day for starters and to show up on this love line so when people come on, they see thousands of people there's thousands of people watching the video games. This is the game of life, man. And we want thousands on here that are pausing, not to so-called chat about worldly stuff, but to love, love back. We're a glorious sun, magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the whole wide world. So we're a we here, Bratch. You know, this little me isolated island is just a 
cool. Man, it just it doesn't work in a universe that's connected and everything interrelated. If you want to know what hell is, it's not a place. It's when we isolate. And you know what cancer is, my friends? It's an isolated cell. And why would an isolated cell get isolated from all the other cells? Because there's not enough love in the system. So we're weak. We're a glorious sun. Magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the whole wide world. Sing it. We're a glorious sun. Magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the whole wide world. We're a glorious sun. Magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the whole wide world. We're a glorious sun. Imagine thousands of us, millions. I swear it's going to happen in our lifetime. We're going to look back when there's just a few of us on this love line and go, Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Love is so powerful and so real. Thousands singing. Good glory, sun. Magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the whole wide world. Good glory, sun. Magnificent love. Radiating our splendor to the possibility day ahead of you. Remember the moments. Remember the f one step at a time. Remember just now. Just now. There's no sense to carry the suffering into the day. There really isn't. It's not real. You got to you got to give up the ghost, man. You got to lay down the the hatchet. You know what I'm saying? So I wish you the most the highest the best of a moment by moment, step by step, love affair with love. Because love needs to be loved as much as you need to be loved. This is a reciprocation. The one who created love needs your love as much as you need that source love. Look at that. We're all in the same boat. Even that, whatever you would say is the cause of all this, we're all in the same boat because there's no cause that would cause something like this universe and create all this created that isn't humble, that isn't you and me. It's not better. That's not a cause to me. That's not something that I would call love. Love is love because it is bonded together, one with. No one better, no one worse, you see? So we are really in this whole thing together. Mortal life and infinite life. We are in it together. Woo, rock star, rock on. Bratch, please come back. 
Maybe give love a follow if you're feeling like it. This could be your, the, it could be, I would swear for all of us, we are all the same deep inside. So I can say 100%, I'd bet my life on it, that we're all looking for the same thing because we are the same thing. So come on back, kids. We're going to discover a treasure. You'll be surprised if I didn't get anything from it. No, that, no, no worries. Hey, love's got you covered. We don't have to feel it. We don't have to get in. No, I'm not surprised at all, Brad, because I'm in, a, I'm in a state of love right now, bro. So wherever you go, it's not my state. It's, it's the universal thing that's got you covered, bro. So thank you for being here, though. Thanks for hanging out these minutes. Never forget you. I mean that. Look at that law of peanut. Call, we call law of peanut. Listen, we're just signing off, but man, please, please receive a ton of the love that everyone just opened to receive and give. We are a we now, law. We come here to breathe, breathe in love, to st restore, to fill up our own individual love tanks, our hearts, and then to share that love with the world, you see? And that's really, it's an activated channel. We just receive and we give. We receive. Haradam, thanks for being on. Even for this split moment, but you may have been on in the in the wings, hiding in the wings. Have a great day, rock star. Love, come back tonight. We're, we're really just suggesting of even five minutes, two minutes, just jump on this love line. Make it one of those non-negotiables, kids, because we need we need love and we need to share this love with our world and we need to show up to that. So come back tonight, everyone, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard, even if it's for two minutes, five minutes, or longer. You've been lurking. I knew it, Haredom. All right. Best day ever. And Bratch, more love ever, man. And we'll, we'll, we'll see you guys in the love stream. Have a great day.